Hello everyone. In this video, I will explain how to install and configure Active Directory Domain Services 0 on Windows Server 2022, where the administrator will be able to easily manage all objects. Installing Active Directory on Windows Server 2022 is not much different from previous versions of Microsoft. Let's get to know the steps. First, open Server Manager Dashboard. Then, click Add Roles and Features. Before you begin, click Next. Then, it will ask you to select installation type. Select Role Based, or Feature Based Installation, and click on the Next button to continue. In this step you will be asked to select Destination Server. In the event that you have more than one server, select the host you want to add the services to. And here he specified this server, and click on the next button to continue. In this step, select the server roles you want to add, and we will choose the Active Directory Domain Services box. And as soon as you choose Active Directory Domain Services a new window appears. Click Add Features. Also, add a DNS server. And also once you choose a DNS server, a new window will appear. Click Add Features. After that make sure that the Active Directory Domain Services and DNS Server options are selected and click on the Next button to continue. In this step, you can add the specified features controller. Just click Next. Because we don't require any additional features at the moment. Here you can read brief information about Active Directory Domain Services. Click Next to continue. You can also read brief information about the DNS Server. Click Next to continue. In this step, all installation options will be displayed for you to check. Then click the Install button to start the installation process. This process may take some time. After completion, we will now configure Domain Controller, which are also very simple steps. The first step is promote this server to a Domain Controller. So, Click Promote this server to a domain controller. In Deployment Configuration, create and install a new forest and new domain. So, select Add a new forest and write the new domain name. And after completion, click on the Next button to continue. In Domain Controller Options, it will define the functional level of the group and the functional level of the domain and type Directory Services Restore Mode Password and click on the next button to continue. 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 Then, click the install button and wait for it to finish. And once completed, it will ask to restart the server. Click the close button, and the server will now make a restart to save all the additions that we have activated. After rebooting the system, the login name is changed to domain name and username. Enter your username and password. There is only one final step left which is to change the DNS server IP addresses. From Server Manager, click on Local Server, on the left side. Then, click on the Ethernet card, and change the DNS server IP addresses. And we will set the server's DNS. I hope the video is useful to you, and thank you for watching. And I also hope to subscribe to my channel. Thank you.